All right, guys, welcome back. Um, I was watching uh, Netflix the other day, as you do, you know, we're all stuck in uh, self-isolation and all that kind of crack, but I think it's kind of lightening up now a wee bit, but we'll see. Um, and I was watching uh, through Netflix and I came across this uh, movie called Coffee and Cream. Um, but mine is gonna be a little bit different. Was it Coffee and Cream or was it... Uh cookies and cream. I'm not too sure. Anyway, it gave me the idea of uh, doing this um, photo today. Um, I've got it semi set up at the moment. I just got to do a few more things. Um, so uh, I'll show you me taking the photo, setting it up and everything and a little bit of editing and we'll see what the image is like then later. So let's crack into it. That's it. Bang! Got it! Yay! Perfect. Alright, so that was uh, an interesting shoot. Um, even though I've got the, the sketchiest setup on the planet, it still worked. Um, you can, you know, you can still uh, use what you've got. All you got to do is just use your imagination just to get that picture created uh, of what you had in mind. Anyway, in saying that, um, things I would have done differently with this photo, I probably would have uh, brightened it up a bit more, more light would have been helpful around the around the edges and stuff. And uh, yeah, that's basically all I would have done, um, was changing the lighting. Uh, I think, um, as you can see from, from the photo, uh, it works pretty well. I had it up at, I had everything in manual, and uh, my shutter speed was on high continuous so I could get the splash and all the little particles and stuff off the, the so-called milk, um, which was only a little bit of milk and the rest was all water, by the way, so I didn't waste any milk, really. My ISO was quite high, that's why the, uh, the, the, the image is a bit grainy. Um, I did try and fix that in post. Um, uh, it did kind of work, but the ISO was like it was up at like uh, uh, 320,000, something like that. So that's why I would have uh, probably lit it better. But whenever I took the photo and looked it on the back of the, uh, the screen of the camera, it looked brilliant, it looked fantastic. But then whenever you look at it on your computer, it's a whole different ball game. So yeah, that's what I would do. Light it better so I can reduce that ISO and keep my shutter speed nice and high. But yeah, in saying that, I, I'm happy with it. Works well, you know, for these days that we're stuck in. You know, I'm not, it's not, I'm not gonna send it in for any competition or anything or make an advert out of it, but it worked. I'm happy with it. But anyway, in saying that, uh, I hope you all learned something out of today, maybe. And uh, if you want, you can, uh, Hit me in the comments down below if you've got any ideas and hit that like button and subscribe. So, with all that said, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.